Why are you going to the Arctic, son? Goo is doing a story on endangered species of the North for her news program. She needs help with a camera and sound equipment. I want to go too, Mother. Darling, when you're older, you'll be able to do things like that. And Minga, there isn't room for more on the helicopter. You can watch the program live right here in our living room, sweetheart. Well, there's the helicopter. Bye. <laughs> Got it. Great, Prickle. Now, come in closer. I thought we were going to photograph animals, not glaciers. Pokey, this is part of their environment. Yeah, Pokey. Wild animals need a habitat just like us. Well, I'm not wild. I don't need a habitat. Never had one in my whole life. <laughs> Pokey! Habitat is the place where you live. <laughs> Boy, these ice cliffs are hundreds of feet high. I'd like to see a big chunk of ice make a big splash in the sea. No such luck. Oh, look at all the seals lying on those little icebergs. The seals are no longer an endangered species since they are now protected from hunters. Well, fellas, here we go up and over the top of the glacier. I don't see any animals on the glaciers. Pokey, just look down now and you'll see why. Yeah, I see. They fall in those crevasses. You guys ready for bear country? Take her away, Prickle. Here we go. The mountains of central Alaska have many types of wildlife. There is the brown bear, the black bear, the mountain sheep, the caribou, and the eagle. Ooh. Hey, Gumby, that looks like a bear. Zoom in on it and see. It's a bear, all right. A big one. We're crossing into the Arctic Zone now, where we'll find walrus, seals, and polar bears. This is a vast polar ice field where polar bears roam hunting for seals and walrus. Uh-oh, fellas. We're just about out of gas. There's a smooth place over there. Looks like an igloo. It was an igloo. I hope nobody was inside. Wellington, they ruined our new igloo. Yes, by Jove, they did. Hey, what are you doing? You wrecked our home. You have to build us a new igloo. Wellington and I will show you how. Our boy and his friends are in trouble. Let's go help them, Professor. Oh, yes, by all means. Minga, you stay with your mother. This block of ice will be our window. I want those sides to be at right angles. Oh, that's right. Uh, we want to have the best look on igloo in the neighborhood. Uh -oh, look, it seems as though we have visitors. Hi, kids. Here's your fuel. What are you doing? Hi, Dad. Hi, Professor. We wrecked the igloo home of this walrus and puffin bird. 
So we rebuild it for them. Oh, Gumby, walruses and puffins don't live in igloos. Some Eskimo hunter left it. All right, Wellington, tell us the truth. Was this igloo yours? Uh, uh, well, uh, uh, we're regular visitors in the neighborhood. Yeah, visitors. I get it. You were just camping out by this abandoned igloo. It's not yours. Uh, listen, I'm sorry. Can I make it up to you by giving you all the chocolate clam dandy you can eat? Sounds fair enough to me, Gumby. Oh, look! This cute little baby bear wants some clam dandy, too. Oh, goodness! The mother will be here any minute! Oh, my! Oh, we must all leave immediately! Oh, come on! Come here! Finish my chocolate clam dandy. <laughs> <laughs> 